Today effing sucks. And I'm troubleshooting light poles again in the same place because for some reason, these 480 light poles keep blowing up and we didn't install them and they were installed a long time ago. We have seven lights out over there. One breaker, one two pole is walling out. It's popping aggressively, like sparking inside the panel, like the panel's jacked up. It's fine, let's go, let's go. Show you what we got here. All right, guys, I'm going to take you through what it's like to troubleshoot this. This is the site plan. It shows me all the manholes and all the light poles attached. So this will basically take me through the chain so I can figure out what's going on. It's not always accurate, but it's better than nothing. So I'm going to turn off all the site lights. I have three breakers here. This top right one is a little bit oxidized and bubbling. I think it might be from tripping so much. So I'm going to order a new one. This was the first light pole I hit, and this is the reason why this light pole didn't work, but it didn't fix everything. So this wire nut is completely melted. I'm going to change it, splice it, make it all nice and pretty. And then I'm going to attach my advanced circuit tracer to the wires that are tripping. And it brought me to this ugly manhole where you can see all the wires are blown up together. There's at least 20 wires that are frayed and blown up. So I'm going to cut everything back here and I am going to clean it up, splice everything nice, and I'm going to take the feed wires off of the breaker and put them on my toner so I can figure out which ones are the feed wires and which ones are the wires to the light poles inside this manhole. I'm wearing my gloves because this is 277 480 and I don't know if everything is completely off in this manhole and I don't know what else could be feeding it so just for safety precautions and I stripped everything back I figured out exactly what was going on I noticed some arc flash on the back of this panel so I took these breakers out and these breakers have been tripping a lot so I'm gonna order a few of these as well because realistically after something trips that often it needs to get changed and I did notice this main speed wire that was completely melted. I don't know if it's a loose connection or what, but I'm gonna keep that panel off for now. And um, when I do the breaker changeover, I'm also going to check that out, make sure the connection's tight, re-splice all that, because that is nowhere near okay. All right guys, so just an update. Basically what we're doing is we're gonna order crimps and shrink wrap and all that good shit. And we are gonna go back in that manhole and tie it all in and um, re-splice literally fucking everything in there. Do that for now, those wires are just safed off and that mm -hmm. side of the panel's turned off. There are three panels for the sight lights and so we just kept the one off that that manhole is even feeding and they'll just not have lights temporarily, it is what it is. But we ordered it from the supply company so they should be coming with it in the next day or two so stay tuned for another video of me doing that. But now I'm going to go home and drink some water.